the 15th chapter, out of the 15th chapter of St. Luke, the 17th verse through the 18th verse. And the 17th verse reads, And when he came to himself, he said, How many hired servants of my father have bread enough to spare, and I perish with hunger? I will arise and go to my father and will say unto him, Father, I have sinned against heaven and before thee. Amen. You may be seated. May God add a blessing to the ears and doers of his holy word. And with those few passages of scripture this morning, amen, I'd uh, like to use for subject today, and that is, there is a danger and doing your own thing. All right. Amen. Uh, man, our Sunday school lesson was just jumping all around. Amen. Uh, subject today. Amen. Mr. Barrow was hit with that just a little while ago. Mr. David was all in it. <laughs> Amen. But uh, there is a uh, danger in doing your own thing. And you know, sometimes we think everything that we do is right. All right now. Amen. Amen. Everything that we do, we got to check out God, the Holy Word, and see if it's in, in line with God's Holy Word. Amen. Amen. And, so, and you know, sometimes we just got to know God's Word before we just try to do things on our own and then end up, amen. You know, it's just like you're going from here to Mississippi, right? And you think that you know the way. Well, I know this go this way, and you end up down in Texas somewhere. Yeah, yeah. And you go like, well, how in the world? Because you decided you thought that you knew where you were going. Well, well. Now you done got out here on one of these old back roads and all this mess. And now you got to go all the way back. And don't forget about all the gas. You know, you got all that money to put gas in your car, two or three dollars a gallon. Huh? Well, because you wanted to do your own thing. Amen. And that's what happens to people today. I, I, I'm so glad that God blessed us Christian folk with, with a mind to think. And I, I thank God that he gave me a mind and ability to think on my own. Amen. Aren't you glad about that? Amen. Aren't you glad that you're not laid around and, and dictated by other folks? Amen. 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 What their opinion are, Amen. is, and whatnot. Amen. When you go to school, do you dictate the teacher lesson that she's trying to put out of her? Because when she gives you the test, it's going to be based on what she taught you. That's right. Can I get a witness? Yeah. She said, well, I thought not read really not know the reading you again because you don't want to do your own thing. Yeah. That's why so many people end up in trouble. Don't you know that's why our jails are full of people because they wanted to do their own thing? Yeah. And they have the right to do their own thing. Isn't that right? Yeah. But, the, but the question is, the sense of question is that it is the right thing. All right. Oh, what is the right way? The right thing that I've done. So we always want to do things the right way. Can I get a witness? That's just like coming out here and get, trying to, uh, to get God to accept coming in our lives. We didn't, we didn't come in here just to sit up in the pews and, and talk and look around, laugh and talk. And Amen. We should come with the right frame of mind to serve the Lord. Yes. Amen. Because we just got to say we came in and walking and, and uh, I'm walking and I'm talking with uh, with my mind on a man named Gay. Can I get a witness? Yeah. In my mind on Jesus, in my mind should be a spiritual thing. Amen. Mm. Because we're looking for spiritual blessing. Well. We're looking for a breakthrough. Hey! Amen. Hey! Oh. Hey! Oh. Hey! Hallelujah. Oh. I feel all right today. Amen. Amen. You know why I feel all right? Because the devil can't harm me. Amen. See, the devil been trying to take over me all the oh. oh. hey, but he can't harm me. Everybody comes down my way. Well, I've been waiting on a breakthrough. Now, you ain't got your mind on Jesus. Ain't nothing going to happen. That's right. Because he'll teach you. He'll teach you the right way. Not your way. Can I get a witness to somebody? Amen. God Almighty. Y'all can make the path to shop before we get started. Hey, okay, it's all, right. all right. It's 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 all right. Amen. Amen. We got some uh, few verses we want to mention this morning. Still on the subject. Mm -hmm. There's a danger in doing your own thing. All right. 
We are on this time in this particular world, my brothers and sisters, when everybody is doing, you see, their own thing. They used to have an old song for me, a song out back home, say, it's my thing, or it's your thing. Do what you want to do. You can't tell me who to sock it to. Huh? Amen. They forget about it after you get through, after you want to do it your way, after you get through socking too. God, the way is standing right there waiting on said, now you done, done all of that. Now you socked and you done, done all that, but I'm still standing right here. All right. It, it's, my, it's still going to be my way. Well, you well, just done what you wanted to do. All right. Huh? All right. Amen. 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 And, 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 and it seems like a way of life, and if you are not doing your thing, you are not with the crowd. Can I get a witness? Yes. And that's the problem. Right. Everybody like running with the crowd. Right. If you're not hooked up with the crowd, you're not with the in crowd, you, you know, you, you're nobody. All right. Now. Can I get a witness? Amen. 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 I, I was proud to be with me. I want to be with them. Come on. <laughs> I want to live like they did. Hang around me. Well, well. Can I get a witness? Amen. Because I got some, I got something to give you. And that is the word to be turned alive. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. But we're hanging around with the crowd on that way to hell. Yeah. Yeah. Can I get a witness? Man. Amen. That's just like this boy here. See, he, 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 this boy that left home, the prodigal son left home because he wanted to do his own thing. Mm -hmm. His head got big. <laughs> huh? Amen. 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 But it is here. But it, but it is I'm here today to tell you there is a danger in doing your own thing. Young people seem like they are uh, 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 weak. Not only young people, but old as well. No. But my sisters and brothers, why did this young man decide to go into a far country? He didn't get up on the wrong side of the bed and come to a desperate conclusion that he would would go out and wreck himself. Well, Can I get a witness? Man. Nobody, everybody think they got some sense. They get up and they decide to go and say, well, I, I, uh, uh, I didn't know. Lord, how did I end up on, I'm an alcoholic. How did I end up on drugs? Well, well, how did I end up a prostitute? Well, all right, well, how did I end up being a fool? Without nothing, no job, no money. Amen. Huh? Well, I didn't wake up this morning to be that way. That's why you got to keep your mind on a man named Jesus. Yeah, yeah. That's why it's too far summer this morning. Ain't that all right? That's all right. Amen, amen. There's a danger. Ah, mm. uh, in, in, in the uh, Proverbs, remind me of Proverbs, the 14th chapter, the and, and the 12th verse said, there is a way. Is that what it said? Mm -hmm. There is a way that seemeth right to a man, but the end thereof is the way of what? Death. Can I get a witness? Mm -hmm. Amen. And, and, and let us note, my brother, when, when, when I learned he or she uh, is on a, and what that is is that when you learn one or he or she is on a, a crowded road, that means that uh, to death, that means that they're on the wrong, traveling on the wrong road. Well, well, sure. Can I get a witness? That's right. Yeah. Amen. And pickable is not that he was tricked, but that he relied heavily on his what? Wisdom. Isn't that right? right. Everybody started out the way. It wasn't that all the time somebody was tricked. It's that they relied on their own wisdom well. rather than turning in humility to God's way. Right. Mm -hmm. Huh? Mm -hmm. Turning humility to God. Sometimes we just got to just say, Lord, I'm in a, a, Lord, I'm in a bad fix, Lord. And, mm -hmm. and just nothing's not right. Mm -hmm. it, nothing's going right. And just say, Lord, mm -hmm. bow down on you. Need the Lord, please, please, Lord, have mercy. Please forgive me. Yes, Step yourself. Yes, Can I get a witness? Amen. 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 To God's way. It is a way. Uh, <coughs> It is a two-way message loaded that leads to life and the other leads to death. Well, well. Isn't that right? Yeah. Right. Amen. Everybody think they got all these choices in life. It only leads to life or it leads to death. Well, 
Well, you can do all and everything, you have all the riches and do all that part and, yeah, and have fun yeah, down yeah. here. That's all, all right, that good right. life. Hey, hey, hey. But right. you know you got forgotten what day you got to die. Yeah, huh? Go. Right. Am I right about it? Yeah. Right. Amen. Now, right. Uh, and also in my study, uh, I'm looking at the, the uh, uh, Deuteronomy, the, the, the eighth chapter and the sixth verse says, Therefore you shall keep the commandments of the Lord, of your Lord God, to walk in his ways. Amen. We still talk about the way. Huh? Mm. To walk in his way. Well. And fear him. Isn't that right? Amen. See, when you walk in the, walk in the law, you strip yourself from all of what you think mm -hmm. and what's right. Well, well, huh? well, well. Amen. You first got to fear the Lord. Isn't that right? Amen. Amen. Fear the Lord. Hmm. John, the 14th chapter. Amen. And the 6th verse says, I am the way. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Is that what he said? All right. And the truth and the life. Is that right? Amen. Amen. I am. We read that in, 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 in our Bible study. Isn't that right? Amen. 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 He said, I am the what? The way. 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 <laughs> God is all right, ain't he? All yes, sir. Oh, yeah. He said, I am the way. And and, 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 and also, he said, uh, 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 the way is, is to, the way is to his what? Father. Isn't that right? Mm -hmm. The truth is, he is, he is the revelation of God as life. And the life, no man cometh unto the Father, but he said, by me. Amen. Have a witness, somebody. Mm -hmm. Amen. Second Peter, the second chapter, and the the 15th verse goes on to say, They have forsaken the right way. Well, huh? Now we ought to ask ourselves the right way. What is the right way? Do anybody know the right way? Or we just blind, blind through life and, and just doing things and, and don't know if it's the right way? Well, huh? Well, think more, I like to know if I'm doing it the right way. Is that right? Yes. Amen. I like Mr. David. He always makes sure he's doing the right way. He has his wife. But honey, is that right? She said, no, man. He said, that ain't the right way. I learned something from him. Amen. I started listening to my wife. Amen. Uh, observing him. Huh? Oh, yeah. He, he, he said they, 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 they forsaken the right way and gone astray following the ways of them, the son of Boa. Well. Amen. Who love the ways of the unrighteousness. Can I get a witness? Everybody remember, you beat the board, remember real well, and I talk about that new fool on a mule on the middle of the road, and the people spoke back to the man, and the big boy said, Pastor, I ain't seen that in no power for the mules, folks. I mean, he yeah, spoke to me. Amen. They did it. Amen. 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 God spoke to a fool on a mule in the middle of the road. Huh? Amen. The, 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 the mule spoke to him and said, he hit, he smacked that mule, and that mule said, Bell down, and he said, Lord, Bell, 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 that's what the Lord is doing today. We want to do our thing our way. It's our way or what? Our way. But the mule fell down because he saw the angel with the sword ready to cut it. And he made another step. The mule fell down to save himself and the fool. All right. Oh, man. Huh? Oh, yeah, because the Lord is doing the same thing today for people that just don't see the angel. 
Amen, amen, amen. The Lord told him to open his eyes and talk to him. Now you go and do what I tell you. All right. Mm -hmm. And when you go up, you speak what I tell you to speak. Not doing your own thing. All right. Is that what he said? Yes. He got sin. All right. He got up there and the man put him bride. There were a lot of folks getting all bride and I by folks. Hey, 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 look, man, I'm going to give you that. I want you to go up there and cut the folks. And God had to bless them and dress them. All right. And say, you can see him sitting around. I don't preach in a minute. He came up and he, he said, okay, man. You can see him take his little money and put it in the pot with it. He going to cuss God's people. Uh -huh. He went up there and when he went up there and he looked out in the plane, my Lord. Could you see it just like a flock of sheep out there in that plane? Huh? God had them bless them, see. God had them borrow them. Huh? See, when, you, when you've been blessed up and dressed up by the Lord, can't nobody touch you. Amen. Right. Amen. I like old Hammer. Hammer say you can't touch this. Huh? <laughs> you know what Hammer say you can't touch this? <laughs> Amen. He looked out and he said, I can't. And when he did, when he spoke, his Lord opened his mouth and instead of cursing, blessing came. Down. Blessing the children of Israel. Mm. Can't nobody curse that, uh, 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 curse that which God had blessed. I'm worried about what folks saying about you. Huh? Amen. 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 Matthew, Matthew, the 11th chapter and the 28th verse. Come all ye that had labor, mm -hmm. and I will give you rest. Yes. Good God, aren't you glad that God will give you rest? Yes, How many of y'all have had restless nights? Amen. Couldn't sleep to save your life? I said, Lord, I need to rest. Good God Almighty. Huh? Going through all of these problems. Amen, amen, amen. He said that for the Jews, you see, they had they had suffered a load of responsibility laid upon them by the priest, uh, rabbi, the scribe, and the Pharisee. Mm -hmm. Huh? Mm -hmm. And that's what people doing today. They're loading you up. All right. As soon as you get Oh, one thing, another one come up. Isn't that right? Right, right. Amen, amen. My dad told me, he said, son, as soon as you get over one mountain and ready to climb over another, he said, look out, somebody got their foot ready to put in your behind. Yes, sir, yes, sir. Huh? Yes, sir. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, this, this young man was not in the least the normal, he was exceedingly, or oh yeah, like you and me. He had no more thoughts when he set out upon the adventure that seemed so full of promises. Can I get a witness? A lot of us started out one way with a, with a whole lot of good intentions in mind. Isn't that right? Yes, sir. Yeah. That's right. Oh yeah, and he ended up, you see, in the hall pen. Isn't that right? Mm -hmm. Amen. Oh, yeah. I don't know if any of y'all have been to the hall green. All right. <laughs> this man ended up, he thought he had it made. Mm -hmm. He was doing his own thing. And ended up in the what? Oh, Eating with the hog, with the swine. Huh? Mm -hmm. hey, Amen. Everybody shouldn't want to just go to sleep with anything. Lay with anything. Can I get a witness? Hey man, I'm not going to be laying up with no hog. He hark, 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 and hark. Lord, I'm not hark. No way. I don't want to be with no hog, no blood. Huh? The only thing I want to have to do with some hogs is maybe give me some ham. Hey, I don't want to be sleeping with something I'm going to eat. Isn't that right? All right. Hey man, but that's where he ended up. In fact, Nobody sets out to deliberately to wreck himself. Nobody make up his mind to advantage of uh, he is going to fly himself into garbage and can uh, of worthlessness and wasted things. Can I get a witness? Yeah. No train leave the station, my brothers and sisters, with his mind made up to end up in a ditch. Isn't that right? Yeah. No ship even leaves the harbor with the grim determination to go up on the rocks. Yeah. Oh yeah, this young man did not go out from his father house with his mind made up that he was going to damn himself. Yeah. 
Can I get a witness? Oh yeah, this young man wanted, you see, to do his his own thing. Amen. Uh, the only reason that he went away was to please himself. Yeah. Isn't that right? Mm. Oh yeah. This young man thought that he would get more freedom in the big world beyond the hills. He thought that was doing his own thing would bring him larger joy in a better time. Oh yeah, generally. He was simply rent on living his own life. Well, well, sir, yes, sir. And I get a witness. Well, there were a lot of us starting out on, we want to do our own thing and live our own life. Yes, so intent he was on pleasing himself that he had thought for any loss or pain that might come to him or anyone else. Yes, Can I get a witness? Yes, this young man, you see, he wounded his father. Mm -hmm. Huh? Oh yeah, he wanted his father, but this was not his purpose. All he was trying to do was to live a life unhampered by any of the restraints that home authority might put up on him. All right. Uh -huh. This is easy. This is easy to understand if if we read the story in light of our own experience. Can I get a witness? Yes. Everybody ought to take time out and, and read uh, Luke the 15th chapter. Mm. Right. Can I get a witness? Yes, sir. Where there is danger, you see, in doing your own thing. But doing your own thing is uh, is the very fountain source of all sins. Why does the bootlegger fly upon his trade? For instance, it is not that he is eager to spit on the flag, mm -hmm. uh, to spit on the flag, or walk rickshaw over the Constitution. It is not that he wants to make a man drunk mm -hmm. and send him reeling down the street in a small hour of night to make a hell of his humble home. Well, mm -hmm. But while he had desire to do civil things, he is willing to do them in order to get to do his own thing. Mm -hmm. Am I right about it? Yes, sir. Many of us are so bent on doing as we please that we are willing to pay deadly price for the privilege. Mm -hmm. Can I get a witness? Yes, sir. Somebody said, I don't I don't care. I don't care what you tell. I don't care what you're talking about. I I'm gonna do what I want to and you can't tell me nothing. Right. Yeah. Isn't that right? That's so, right. Yes, sir. I thought about telling you there's a danger in doing your own thing. Mm -hmm. Huh? Yeah. Right. Amen. Amen. Doing your thing is expensive. Mm -hmm. Nothing can be more so. He who has been on pleasing himself is doomed to pay the terrible price. Nor is he the only one that paid. No man ever sinned without wounding someone else. Amen. Can I get a witness? Amen. Amen. It's bad when you, you're causing other folks pain behind what you are doing. Can I get a witness? Yes, Amen. Uh, uh, there's true recklessness of secret and sin may be. I may sin, and no one knows it but God and myself. Well, Yet, well. even then, I involve others. Have a witness? Yes, Why have we got to get other folk mixed up in our mess? Okay. Huh? Why you can't just go on if you're going to wreck your life, go on, do your own thing, and, th and, and, and doing your own thing is worth it, then you're going to wreck other folk's life with you? All right, all right, all right. Huh? Man, man. Hey, man, you know that's why some folks are following monkey, dogs, and everything. You know, folks, I don't know why folks are doomed on wrecking them on the set. Huh? Oh, yeah, there's a danger in doing your own thing. It calls this young man the fellowship of his father. Yes, sir. Am I right about it? Right. Is that what it right. read in Luke 15? Yes, sir. And all the joy, you see, 
of his own home, huh? In his father's house. Good God Almighty. I, I can see that he never had no doubt to take a look back at his father's house in the hall pen. Mm. He said, man, what in the world am I doing? I ain't in the hall. My dad got all of this. Mm -hmm. And I'm down here in a hall pink. Well, well. Huh? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This doing your own thing will cost you your freedom. For it is the freedom that we go through to seek this young man. This young man, can you see him right now? My brothers and sisters said, give me. Mm -hmm. Huh? How many of you heard your children talk about, give me? Yeah. Huh? Mm -hmm. He said to his father in the hour of his will, when his heart was broken, he said, make me. There is a difference between these two requests than there is between life and death. Mm. But give me, he said first. But this, he meant I must be free. I must do as I please. Yes. The road we sometimes look for some uh, for freedom leads into slavery. Mm -hmm. Doing your own thing will cause you your very all. We will become moral and spiritually bankrupt. Mm -hmm. This young man did not spend all his treasure in a, a single day. Mm. He spent a little and a little bit at a time. Mm. All right. Even as you and I, little by little, he parted with the treasure till he had spent all that he had. Well, well. Have I witnessed somebody? All right. Mm. Amen. 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 Some of us, we won't realize sometimes we don't spend all. Mm. Seems like we will wake up. Isn't that right? Yes, sir. Huh? There's a danger in doing your own thing. Well, this young man came to himself. Glory, hallelujah. Hey, all right, all right. Say glory, hallelujah. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> Just like you and I, we came to our shop one day. Yes, sir. It's good when one comes to himself, and he, and he was in the hall pen. That's right, boy. Because see, all the other stuff, all the good life and the bright life, good God Almighty. Woo! All the girls that he had laid in here, they done kicked him out. He didn't have no home. He was homeless. That's about life was sitting you when you done spent all to the off man. Huh? Can I get a witness? All the folks smiling in your face and I love you, I love you. They ain't gonna get run out of money. They ain't gonna send you to the off man. I don't know if you ever been home. Broke. Huh? Didn't have a dime. Mm. Amen. I'm not trying to pick on nobody. I'm just preaching on myself because I've been there. Yes, sir. Huh? Amen. Boy, anybody get mad today, he said, well, he said he's been there, so he ain't picking on me. Any right, Sister Rollins? Amen. Don't <laughs> think I'm picking on you. Amen. Coming to himself means that he's not only recovering his sanity, but have done so. He bears face, uh, the facts about himself. <laughs> this young man thought to dare to take a good square look at himself. Amen. And looking is what he discovered. I perish with hunger. Mm -hmm. Huh? Can you see him now down in the hog pen on filling, filling his belly with the food that the, that the hog ate? Mm -hmm. yes, huh? Oh, yeah. And he said, Lord, I'm down here dying mm -hmm. with hunger. Mm -hmm. I'm starving to death, Lord. Mm -hmm. I mean, I don't know if anybody ever been, been, been in a situation like that. Well, well. Amen. When you, got, when you go somewhere, you ought to know where are you going and what you're going to do when you get how you going to provide food, a job, a way to make a living before you even go there. Isn't that right? And get there and end up and say, Lord, how in the world did I end up down here? Well, well. Pregnant with two and three children and the man that went off and left me all alone. I'm not here. Well, fat. Mm. 
Come on, Pastor. I'm the one that I ain't not gonna mess like this. Mm -hmm. Right. Somebody get a job. I can't get no job with all these kids who ain't got no money to pay the All right. Come on. And wreck mm. your life. Can I get a witness? Well, well. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. And not only so, but I am starving, needless. Is that right? <laughs> you, don't have, you don't have to suffer like this. On, you don't have to even go through all this mess that you go through. <laughs> I don't have to be in this shape. Can I get a witness? Man. Mm -hmm. And then, no doubt, when you look, and, look at this young man, he said, and then now, he looked back at his father's house. How many servants did my father have in his house and, oh. and high hand? Huh? Uh -huh. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. Uh -huh. He had bread enough to spare. Uh -huh. How foolish to die when the rich boom of life might be his own for taking. Uh -huh. Having come to himself, he came to a decision, <coughs> and what decision was it? Listen to it. He said, I will rise and reform. Come on, come on. Hey, hey, hey. Ain't that the right thing to do? Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Now that it is not, uh, he said, now I will rise and reform. But no, that is not what he said. Reform is good. But I, is, but is, not enough. I will arrive and join the church. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. mm. No. Mm -hmm. That ain't what he said. Mm. Mm. Huh? Joining the church is altogether right and worthwhile, but joining the church, you see, is not enough. Mm. All right. Am I right about it? That's right. Oh, yeah. I will rise and go to work. <laughs> <laughs> well, that is too, too good. Jesus said to the paralyzed man, Arise, take up thy bed, and what? Walk. Walk. We can all together write the proper, but the resolution is the pleasure of seeking more fundamental still. Mm -hmm. I stop by to tell you, my brothers and sisters, there's a danger in doing your own thing. But I'm so glad that when I look at this young man, oh yeah, when he came to himself, yes. can you see him right now all dirty, raggedy, like they beat him down, nobody didn't have no place to go, no food to eat, well, huh? He made an intelligent inquiry. He said, I will now rise. <laughs> Good God Almighty, somebody might be in the hall pen today. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. He said, I will not rise and go to my father. Hey, hey God, all right. Oh, yeah, I can see. I can see this young man. Oh, yeah. As he arrives to go to his father's house. Yes, sir. Y'all come and go with me a little while. I'm getting ready to close. Hey, Amen. See, y'all gonna be all right. Yes. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. But I, I can see him as he got up out the hog pen. Can y'all see him right now? Yeah. Break the dust off it. Uh huh. And so, oh yeah, I know I made some mistakes. Yeah. Good God Almighty, but uh, I'm going home yeah. to my father's house. Yeah. In my father's house. Yeah. Good God Almighty. Yes. He got plenty of bread to feed. Yeah. <laughs> in my father's house. Yeah. Good God Almighty, there's peace. Yeah. In my father's house. Yeah. Good God Almighty. Now, can't you see this young man as he began to walk on down the road? Yeah. I can see somebody. Good God Almighty, all the so called friends. Yeah. Peace souls. Saying, uh, oh yeah, Rutland. Oh, where are you going, Rutland? Good God Almighty, I can hear him say, Good God Almighty, I'm going back uh, to my father's house. Good God Almighty, because in my father's house, uh, good God Almighty, he had hot set. Uh, in my father's house, uh, good God Almighty, he'd have a bed. Good God Almighty, where I can lay my head. 
Good God Almighty, can't you see this young man, y'all, uh, going on down? Uh, good God Almighty, Sam, uh, I'm going back now. Good God Almighty, can I make it a little human today? I'm going back to Georgia. <laughs> good God Almighty. <laughs> I could see this young man uh, as he got down. Uh, good God Almighty and pushed the ticket uh, and stepped on board. Uh, yes. Good God Almighty. Ha, that's what we all got to do one day. Uh, yes. You got to give up self. Uh, oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Uh, you got to step on board. Uh, you got to give up. Uh, good God Almighty and face humility in your life sometimes uh, and step on board. Uh, I could see this young man uh, headed toward his father's house. Uh, good God Almighty, when you see him got off uh, that old train, he was riding on the ship uh, and started walking uh, or walking toward his father's house. Uh, good God Almighty, he might not have had some fishing clothes. Uh, he might not have been smelling so well. Uh, yeah, well. Good God Almighty, but ain't you glad? Uh, good God Almighty, that God will, uh, he will take you back this morning. Yeah, yeah. Right. Uh, good God Almighty, aren't you? glad that we serve a, a forgiving God. Uh, aren't you glad, good God Almighty, we serve a, a caring, loving God. Uh, he will take you back. Uh, good God Almighty, I can see him uh, as he headed on uh, ahead to his father's house. Speak. Uh, good God Almighty, uh, I see his father uh, standing out there uh, uh, look way across the fields. Uh, good God Almighty, and said, that look like hey 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 hey, hey. 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 Oh, that look like Good God, aren't you glad that God knows you? <laughs> no matter what you've done in your life, uh, good God Almighty, God knows his own. Uh, good God Almighty, that look like uh, my child uh, uh, coming over those hills and mountains. Uh, uh, sometime, church, uh, you're going to come over rough hills and mountains. Uh, uh, sometimes, a uh, uh, thing not going to be the way that you want it. Uh, uh, sometimes, uh, good God Almighty, you're going to have to cry sometime. Uh, Good God Almighty, but he went out. Uh, I could see the father uh, throw his arm uh, around the son uh, yeah. and say, Welcome home. Hey! Yeah. Welcome home, oh, my child. My son, uh, he's alive. Uh, he's not dead. Oh, Aren't you glad uh, that you said the God? Uh, he's not dead. Uh, he's still alive. Uh, he's waiting. Uh, he's listening uh, for your faintest cry. Uh, and he hasn't forgotten about you. Aren't you glad? Uh, I said, uh, bring me a robe uh, and put it on him. Uh, uh, bring me a ring and put it back on his finger. Uh, and see him restoring it back in. Yeah. Good God Almighty. Not only that, say go and kill the fattest calf. Yeah. My son, yeah. oh, he was dead, but now he's alive. Yeah. Ain't he all right? Yeah. Ain't he all right? Yeah. Good God Almighty. I'm so glad. Good God Almighty. I know a man. His name is Jesus. Right. When I don't carry a cross one day, yeah. I, I hung, bled, and died for you and I. Good God Almighty. Love told him to, to take her back. Hey, hey. Mm. Mm. Aren't you When you weren't fit to leave or die. Yeah, hey! Uh, somebody going through it right now in the hall. And they don't even know. <laughs> Love said, I'll take you back. Yes. Woo. Thank you, Father. Yes. Stop doing your own thing. Yes. 